Epic Games has officially confirmed Fortnite Chapter 6 and Fortnite OG. I'm going to give my thoughts and I would love to know what you guys think about it down below in the comment section afterwards. Hello everybody and welcome back to another video. If you are new here, my name is Kyle. I'm your guy with too many YouTube channels. Well, guys, let's talk about Fortnite Chapter 6. So, Aiko had this to say on Twitter and this is what a lot of leakers have been saying. Chapter 6 news, V33.00 recently got added to the internal servers and is likely Chapter 6 Season 1, probably releasing around December. And what this tweet does not say, and a lot of leakers are saying this as complete confirmation that with this also confirms Fortnite OG will be happening right before that. So it looks like we're going to have the four seasons of Chapter 5, just like we did in Chapter 4. OG Fortnite's going to happen again, and then we are going to move on to Chapter 6. So... Here's the thing, I'm actually a little bit conflicted with this because I have been somebody who has been, if you guys have been following the channel, you would know I've been pretty back and forth on how much I like the idea of yearly chapters. Now, since chapter 4, I am totally 100% on board with having maybe even 6 seasons, like 1.5 years. I want more time to enjoy the map, to build it, to follow the story throughout the chapter, but I'm not going to lie to you guys, with chapter 5... I don't mind the idea of getting off of it so quickly. There's just been a lot of things in Chapter 5 that I really don't like personally, but would Chapter 6 even change that? The only thing that I really hope for Chapter 6 that I think is very possible is Epic Games scraps the entire no-hit-scan type thing and the attachments. I don't like them. I've had... And don't get me wrong, guys. I, need, I feel like I need to say this all the time. I'm still really enjoying Fortnite. My dog is playing with a bone right next to it sorry if he's picking up on the mic <laughs> there now she's chewing i oh other side i know she i got her chewing it on the couch over here <laughs> sorry if that was picking up in my mic i'm not sure if it was but anyways <laughs> like i was saying i still really really enjoy fortnite i'm having a blast with the game but i really hate attachments and hit scan i or the lack of hit scan i don't like it it's not the fortnite that i've come to enjoy but at the end of the day like i said i've still been really really enjoying the game i would just really prefer the game without that stuff so with chapter 6 comes early i'm hoping that epic games kind of does the augment thing and just scraps it because to be honest with you it seems like the majority of the player base doesn't like it but i could be wrong i was wrong about augments <laughs> i'm still shocked that everybody is okay with augments being on i absolutely love that so that's the type of stuff where i'm kind of sitting here and i'm back like Okay, well, Chapter 6 could definitely improve on that things. If you really want to get into it, they could improve the locker. If you want an entire chapter for Charlie Wendon to, to really dive into a Fortnite storyline, although I'm not even so confident on that anymore because throughout Season 2 right now, the storyline still has been picking up. We had so much potential. I don't know, man. I'm not, I'm not in high hopes or high spirits for the Fortnite storyline right now. I don't love the way that Chapter 5 is going, so I'm kind of sitting here like, I don't mind the idea of Chapter 6. And honestly, guys... Makes me a little bit more excited for OG Fortnite. I loved Chapter 4. The gameplay for Chapter 4 was phenomenal. I even enjoyed Wilds, okay? So OG Fortnite coming was very pleasant to me. It was nostalgic. It was great. It brought back a couple people that I missed playing Fortnite with. But I was still ready to move on to Chapter 5 because, I, again, I enjoyed Chapter 4 so much. But I'm, I don't want you to guys get to get the wrong idea. Like, I'm not with a lot of the player base that's online right now where it's like, oh my god, Chapter 5 needs to end. I can't stand it anymore. It's just, the game is in the state where I've enjoyed it the least out of the entire history of Fortnite. But don't get me wrong, again, I, I apologize, I keep repeating myself. I just really hope you guys don't get the wrong idea. I still love the game. <laughs> I'm, I'm playing tonight at the time of recording this video, and I can't wait to play with my friends. It's going to be a blast, you know what I mean? So, uh, but... Throughout Chapter 5 so far, it is the least I've been enjoying Fortnite. So, moving on to Chapter 6, moving on to OG Fortnite is something that I'd be really looking forward to, especially with the idea of having Chapter 2 OG. I think that that's something Epic Games is certainly open to doing. I would love that infinitely more than Chapter 1. Oh, could you imagine? Could you imagine? I still want to make a video on how I would handle that or I, how I would handle OG Fortnite coming back. What's weird to me, too, is... How are they going to handle the transition to Chapter 6? Because we had the time machine with Kato Thorne. It all made sense. We went back to OG Fortnite. The end event came. And I know it was a little bit of a collaboration or like a big ad, the event. But the storyline was still there because we were back in time. The end event took place. It was just a different conclusion to the end event. How are they going to handle this time? Because they can't do the same thing. They can't just go back and have the end event unless they go to Chapter 2. Then they can do... That end event again. But if they do OG Fortnite every single year, what's going to happen after that? Chapter 3? 
<laughs> you imagine we get we get fracture again <laughs> i would actually be really really down for a chapter 3 og Forda because i chapter 3 is fantastic especially season 1 season 2 season 3 was okay <laughs> but season 4 was fun too like there's a lot of great things i miss the chrome i'm just getting ahead of myself over here guys like the, the ideas that could happen for OG Fortnite really, really excite me. So my point with all of this is the reason why I was talking about not liking Chapter 5 so much is it's making me look forward to OG Fortnite a little bit more because I've enjoyed pretty much everything else that Fortnite has done outside of Chapter 5. So no matter what they do with OG Fortnite, I'm here for it. They handled the first time. They handled it the first time around amazingly. The OG map was awesome. I loved playing with the old loop pool. Oh, could you imagine we go back because it's still chapter five and all of the OG weapons have no hit scan? I'd be like, oh my God, that'd be wild. But at least I would have impulse grenades. At least I could, I don't know. I don't know. They're, they're going to add a lot of stuff that is really lacking from chapter five. Chapter five has been pretty bland so far. They vaulted, <laughs> they vaulted the Zeus lightning bolt, which I was having a lot of fun with. But what can you do? At least the avatar mythics are pretty fun. I don't hate them like a lot of the player base have been hating them. So guys... I'm excited for chapter six. I think it is best that we move on after one year this time around. Typically, like I said, I am totally on the two year train, but I'm kind of ready to be out of chapter five personally. But hey, you know what? Maybe next season could be an absolute banger. Maybe we'll get a live event. I don't know. It's a little bit too early to tell. I'm always sitting here. I'm enjoying the game. I'm ready for Fortnite to give us a chance. It's going to be a blast, guys. But guys, before we end the video today, I do want to ask. Have you checked out PBJ's channel, by the way? PBJ has been making some banger storyline videos. And today, we have a video right here where you can react to it. Check it out, guys, and then go show PBJ some love. I would love to see you over there. Take care.